We are in Essex with our on-screen Essex boy looking to film pests, especially foxes, and pest control. I've been invited out tonight because it's my friend's beautiful house. And it's his uncle's house, actually. And the rabbits are just taken over. It is ridiculous. But unfortunately, with the rabbits, brings the foxes. Now, down the road there, in the next woods, is a really, really big chute. And they are really fed up with all these foxes. So tonight, it's night vision night. Now, we know Roger best for his air gunning exploits with his flashy BSA. His foxing rifle is also a little bit out there, for the traditionalist anyway. This is my pride and joy. It's an AR style rifle, 223 straight pull. One in eight twist, which means it favours the heavier bullet, lovely. Cracking little foxing tool, I've got to be honest. I love it. The nice thing about it is, because it's got rails everywhere, you can hang your washing off it, it does everything. James, what are you doing? So it's quite straightforward really, the, the One Shot Zero program. You, you cycle through the menus until you get to the One Shot Zero and then effectively what you do is you shoot at the target and keep in the crosshairs on the centre and then you hold the um, gun and the crosshairs on the centre and you effectively move the crosshair to correspond with the point of impact and then once that's done you set that in which locks your new point of impact on the crosshair. We are zeroed and head out to where we're shooting tonight. Roger is keen to test his new fox caller, a present from David, because foxes are a problem on the news stump. It, these things are amazing, apparently. I just sound awful, I know, but I'm going to have a go at calling something in with this. Not that we really need to, because there'll be a cross here in a minute anyway. Um, so, should we have a bash? Let's have a go. If you watch and enjoy Roy Lupton's calling techniques, we are so sorry. Not surprisingly, all we have before us are rabbits, but it's enough to get a taster of what the Pulsar N970 LRF has to offer. It is fantastic. It's, I mean, the clarity is phenomenal. It is absolutely phenomenal. You can see down 200 yards rabbits with ease. I mean, it's, you know, so a fox at that range, you'd be at a nail easily. I mean, there's no two ways about it. It is fantastic. Um, I am blown away by it. The rangefinder I've worked out how to use, it's fantastic, it works a treat and uh, seems jolly accurate because I put it against my loophole and uh, yeah, bang on, exactly the same. So, so far so good, it's just a waiting game at the moment. Roger keeps calling and finally, we're in luck. A fox comes towards the call and positions itself in front of us with a good backstop. And it's down. We pick up the fox and Roger is happy with his night's work. Pulsar works a treat. Fox is gone, that's it, done job jobbed. Happy with that, clean shot, straight out. It looked, I was a bit worried because I thought maybe I've hit it wrong. I didn't, yeah. It was a heart shot, straight out, done. Uh, straight to the boiler room. We waited around for a while, but I tell you what, the Pulsar N970 LRF came to fruition and it worked perfectly. Lovely little shot, 90 yards it was. Um, yeah, bang on. Very, very happy with that. Can't wait to get out with it again. Um, it's definitely doing the job. The Pulsar N970 LRF we are using comes from Thomas Jacks. Visit thomasjacks.co.uk. And we're going to be there when Roger gets more new toys from Thomas Jacks to play with as he works his way around Essex, keeping the fox numbers down. <laughs>